My name is Kevin Nielsen and I'm the president and CEO of EcoCanada. I took the CEO position at EcoCanada because I'm very passionate about the work that EcoCanada does. So when the opportunity came along for me to return to be the CEO in 2016, I was, uh, it was a very easy choice for me to make. So I was personally very motivated to work in the Canadian environmental industry because it's an industry in growth and it's an industry that really caters to a lot of people. The general population in Canada is, cares very much about the environment. All various levels of government is really committed to it. And you see a lot of companies coming into the sector, new technologies being invented. You have professionals with all kinds of science backgrounds, with engineering backgrounds, with finance backgrounds. So it is really an exciting sector to be in and it's, it's, uh, it's booming. When EcoCanada was established in 1992, no environmental programs existed at uh, universities and colleges. Today, you won't find any colleges and universities without at least one environmental science program. But we are faced with a challenge, and that challenge is that the baby boomers, that are sort of the pioneers of the environmental sector, are retiring. Our labor market research suggests that 22% uh, of the workforce will retire in the next 10 years. And we're also seeing a struggle for young people to get into the sector and get their first jobs. One of our vision at EcoCanada is to create the world's leading environmental workforce. And we try to do that through our EP program. And our goal is that the EPs are going to be sought after across the world. Uh, we've seen that now with, uh, with the government of Mongolia coming and approaching us. They want us to come over and, 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 uh, and help us teach them uh, how things are done in Canada. Uh, and we're excited about that opportunity and we hope to see more of that. Where Canadian expertise and the knowledge and the wisdom that we have with our professionals here can be an export uh, good. So one of our goals at EcoCanada is to elevate the credibility of professionals and raise that bar. And we think that the EP certification is one mechanism to do that. If people are uh, held to a higher standard and are meeting that standard, that would be one of the mechanisms to really ensure that the general public is more aware that there is such a thing as an environmental profession.